Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel. Uh, you are looking at Evan and Evan is the Will Be Kit by Cassie Brace or Cassie Love, um, whichever one she's using now. Um, brought to life by Shirley Jones. Now I'd like to get um, little Evan in a lovely little two piece. Um, and that's this. It's a lovely soft knit in a petrol blue. So, you know, you know, basic bl uh, blue for a boy, pink for a girl kind of routine. But uh, yeah, this is, it's got a cable knit in it and uh, faux wooden buttons all the way down. Um, it is very soft. It's not um, in the least bit spiky or itchy. So, yeah, I'm really liking that. And it also has a hat with little ears on it. And now the hat is a little bit too big for Evan, but it doesn't matter. I can, like, make the brim roll back a bit. But I do like this because it's got the ear detail on it um, because it kind of elongates his head rather than it just being a beanie on a little round head if you see what I mean so that's what we're changing him into uh, and I picked I picked up bought um, a couple of other things as well which I'll show you as soon as we've got this little man dressed so just let me get a little bit closer to him um, as I'm lying on the bed I could have done this on the changing table um, but I decided I wanted to be comfy and I'm very close to the radiator because honestly it's gone so cool. Um, it's been a manically busy Saturday actually for me uh, and uh, really busy outside. Um, whether people are, I don't know, in the Christmas mood already. I mean, there is a case for that I suppose. But the roads are really, really busy today uh, and the shops. So yes. Um, I went out uh, shopping again <laughs> yesterday, but it uh, it was for things for me more than anything. Um, and I was delighted to find that while I was out, um, there was a Charlotte Tilbury shop. Now, I do like me some Charlotte Tilbury makeup, I must admit. Um, and as a rule, I mean, I've had very few actual Charlotte Tilbury products. I've always bought the, the dupes from Aldi. But yesterday I went into the into um, Charlotte Tilbury itself and thought, do you know what? I'm going to try the real stuff. I'm going to try the real deal. Oh my God, it's so good. It's so good. I've basically said goodbye to the dupes of Charlotte Ch Tilbury. Um, I mean, I, I popped, I put my makeup on this morning uh, before I went out uh, to do a few bits and pieces, and it, it's still there now. It's not budged. My makeup is, oh, still in place, still looking good. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, that's just as an aside. I mean, I'm usually the dupe queen, you know, really happy to to have a dupe. Um, not with Charlotte Tilbury, my goodness, the actual stuff. Although, you know, kind of you takes your breath away with the price of it. But I can't imagine... Um, the the blusher set and high the blusher highlight set um and all the other bits and pieces i got uh are going to run out this side of next year do you know what i mean because it's so heavily pigmented and that's got nothing at all to do with babies i know terribly sorry and all that so he has uh on him a bamboo nature nappy which i'm not going to alter i'm not going to switch out to a different one i am going to keep him with a nappy on uh, for added bulk um and if you look closely at this kit as i've done with previous kits nothing pisses me off about this kit nothing about the Wilby kit pisses me off um as i've said um with me other reborns that I've, I've mentioned there's always been a something um but this one nothing nothing annoys me 
nothing. He's got no awkward twists in his wrists. The hand gestures are beautiful. Uh, he has a rest, a resting hand, which is something I really like. I appreciate a resting hand, you know, so that you can just rest on his little um, chest there or be up like that, you know, or it can hold on to something sometimes as well. The resting hand I really love. The shape of the fingers I really love. Um, he's not too skinny or too fat. He has a newborn baby fat rolls. Absolutely delicious. This um, little fist hand is a gorgeous little clench. It really, really is a lovely, lovely little kit. Um, and... The elbows are also well, well designed, well imagined. They come to a realistic and sweet little point. His head shape is accurate, really rather sublime. You know, slightly elongated at the back. Um, yeah, I can't fault this kit. Obviously, this is from my point of view, uh, but honestly, I, I don't, I can't see anything in this kit that I would say, yeah, but you know. It's a beautiful kit, it really is. So I've got literally no complaints and obviously no complaints about the paintwork uh, because uh, basically Shirley Jones has ruined me for all other babies. I have been looking around because uh, I do fancy a fresh face. Uh, maybe, possibly, I'm not in an urgent rush or anything like that, but I, I've been like looking around for a new face. Um, Nothing struck me. I've seen a couple of Shirley babies um, that I'd consider, but not that have like really punched me in the face and said, buy me, buy me. Do you know what I mean? Um, so, yeah, um, options are open. Um, you know, <laughs> a candidates can um, email me. <laughs> With their full CV <laughs> and whether I want to purchase them. <laughs> um, but as yet, I've not stumbled across anything and I'm, I'm leaving it to baby can find me. You know. Let's set this little boy's hat on. Um, I might actually just pop these cream socks on. Uh, I think these are the ones with the hole in. If, or, or are they not? Uh, is this another pair I have? I, I mean, I think I've got some blue socks, but not to hand. Yeah, we'll just we'll just pop these cream ones on for now. There's no need to get too precious about it, is there? Um, yeah, that's what I want to say. Yeah, I'm liking that. I'm liking that look. I think that's cute. Now let me pop, pop his little hat on. Thus, oh, <laughs> disappears off behind himself. Give it a right big roll up like that. Maybe my little ears. Might have to nip it out um, so that it fits him. But yeah, that's it's actually really rather too big. I think I'm going to have to nip it out. Hang on, just let me nip it out. I'm going to nipping it out, as it were. Um, yeah, that looks a lot better than how it was going, but it's still much too big as far as I'm concerned. So might need a stitch in the back, but he does look okay in this hat uh, because you're proper newbornish. Do you know what I mean? Like the hat's too big and his little face is too small and nothing's working. <laughs> I love that look. So, yes, he is, he is now complete. Um, and I will take some photos um, as well. Um, now I want to show you the couple of things that I bought in. It's only a couple of, uh, just one set in a, like an all-in-one. Uh, but I got this, yeah, I got this yesterday. Uh, I got this with the Hello. Um, this is in, um, oh, I'm going to say, I'm going to say it's like a naught to 3. So it's pretty much too big for the very little ease, but Louis can wear this. Um, and I'm still fixated with the chain knit stitched wording on the things i like the little knee pads affair i like that too so this is um like a beige color 
with uh, like a gold hello, dark gold hello on it. Really like that in in nice like coffee coffee coloured stripe I would say. So I got that. And this, which I just could not leave on the shelf. It, there was just no way this was being left on the shelf. Affair with balloons and uh, rainbows. Um, couldn't leave it in the shop because of the balloons. Like me a balloon now and again. So that's the top and it's in like a caramel colour. And they are the bottoms, which always come in useful um, as separates, you know. So, yeah. And again, that will fit Louis um, because he's... Just and so big enough for like a naught to three, and a naught to three month month item will be baggy on him, but it looks cute. You know, it does look like snuggly wuggly, and that's all I have for you today. Um, I'm going to get off and take some pictures of this little man, see if I can find him a little lover or something, and I'll catch you in another video very soon. Bye, guys.